In this video, we perform the explantation of an artificial colored iris in a young female patient who was referred to us for ocular hypertension and corneal endothelial cell loss. We perform a superior clear corneal incision of 2.4 mm before injecting viscoelastic into the anterior chamber to protect the endothelium and behind the artificial iris to separate it from the natural iris. These devices usually have five anchoring processes that can adhere strongly to the iris. Once the device is separated from the iris, we use Chang IOL cutter scissors to create a tab in the inferior part of the device. We then use a micro forceps such as Macpherson forceps to remove the device from the anterior chamber. It is crucial to fill the anterior chamber with viscoelastic before manipulating the device in order to protect the few remaining endothelial cells. Before removing the viscoelastic, we search for anterior iridocorneal sinuci that can be viscodissected if necessary. Finally, we perform hydrosuture of the corneal incision. It is very important to warn your patients of the risks associated to such devices. Thank you for watching.